There is so much beauty in our differences. No two people are alike, and each of us has characteristics that make us uniquely and distinctly us. But there's mystery in those differences too, especially when it comes to medicine. In the past, diagnostics allowed us to generally understand a disease. But analyzing, understanding, and treating its unique properties were out of reach. Until now. The future of healthcare is here. Diagnostics are an important part of every stage of medical care. In fact, 70% of medical decision making is influenced by diagnostics, and that makes molecular diagnostics one of the most important advances in the last century. Simply put, Molecular diagnostics are tests that detect specific genetic sequences and proteins to help make individualized and therefore more effective medical decisions for patients. The Society for Women's Health Research works to understand diseases and conditions that affect women more than or differently from men. We know that in every instance, from cardiovascular disease to cancers, molecular diagnostics provide the critical insights we need, and a simple journey through the body tells a very compelling story. Let's start with the heart. Coronary artery disease is a common precursor to heart disease, currently the leading cause of death for women. The symptoms are different in men and women, making it difficult to diagnose. Traditional methods of diagnosing CAD are costly and invasive and far less effective in identifying the disease in females. But that reality is changing, due in part to a test that takes into account key biological differences between men and women. By measuring the activity of specific genes in the blood that are altered by narrowing or blockage of heart arteries, this test uses unique properties to provide a more accurate diagnosis, particularly for women. Better yet, the test is non-invasive, requires no radiation exposure, and can be completed in as little as 72 hours. Statistics show that one in eight women will be diagnosed with breast cancer in her lifetime, making it almost as dangerous as heart disease. For women with a mutation in the BRCA1 or BRCA2 gene, the risk of developing breast cancer is up to 80%. Before molecular diagnostics, breast cancer could only be detected after it developed. Now, a simple blood test or oral rinse can detect certain gene mutations, enabling physicians to understand future risk and giving us the ability to make important medical decisions before cancer starts. And, in cases of metastatic breast cancer, where tumors have spread to other parts of the body, we can now determine whether individual patients will respond favorably to their personal treatment plan. Molecular diagnostics helps us understand her breast cancer, not just breast cancer generally, and saves time in finding a better treatment option if the current one isn't working. We also know that women with the BRCA gene mutation have a risk of up to 40% for developing ovarian cancer by age 70. But did you know that among those diagnosed with ovarian cancer, 60% do not get the professionally recommended standard of care? Many ovarian cancer patients do not have the appropriate specialist perform their first surgery. This can have a harmful impact on the chances of successful treatment. Molecular diagnostics bridges the gap between diagnosis and treatment with an FDA-cleared test that can identify ovarian cancer with 95% accuracy. Used with traditional cancer tests, this diagnostic helps physicians determine the most effective course of treatment and the right surgical specialists. This leads to improved quality of care and survival rates up to 30% better. And that brings us to the next groundbreaking example of molecular diagnostics. Colorectal cancer is considered by medical professionals to be the most preventable but the least prevented cancer. As one of the top three most common cancers among women, it's clear that colorectal cancer is a serious health threat. As many as 75% of colorectal cancers are not inherited, but the result of genetic alterations in the cell. 
Recently, a test was developed to target gene mutations in the DNA of cells shed by growing cancerous and precancerous tumors, alerting doctors to the possible presence of precancerous polyps and colon cancer with an accuracy of more than 90%. Thanks to these innovations, we're on our way to making colorectal cancer into the most preventable and most prevented cancer. Unique diagnostics are also being used to improve early detection and treatment of sexually transmitted diseases. More than 19 million cases of STDs occur in the United States each year. Left untreated, STDs can cause serious health problems in women, ranging from infertility to increased risk for HIV infection. There are 100 or more genetically distinct types of HPV, with eight types responsible for almost all cases of cervical cancer. Women are also significantly affected by chlamydia, with 2.5 times the rate of infection over men. The symptoms can be misunderstood, causing the infection to go untreated. Without the right diagnosis and treatment, chlamydia can cause significant long-term health problems in women from pelvic inflammatory disease to infertility and possibly deadly complications during pregnancy. Thanks to molecular diagnostics, we can now quickly and accurately detect HPV and chlamydia before they turn into a bigger problem and determine which treatments would be most effective. Our journey ends with some of the most challenging to diagnose and least understood illnesses, those dealing with our mental health. About one quarter of all Americans will face mental illness in their lifetime. Depression is one of the most common mental disorders and women are 70% more likely than men to experience it. Treatment is often trial and error. Half the time the initial prescription doesn't work and different medications are tried until one does. This is frustrating, time-consuming and potentially dangerous. Technology now exists to use a simple blood test to determine what will work the first time around. Variations in our genes affect our response to antidepressant and antipsychotic medications. Molecular diagnostics measures and analyzes these variations in our blood, giving us a personalized picture of which medicine best fits our distinct genetic makeup. The technology also shows great promise for helping to unlock the answers to treating other diseases like seizure disorders and Parkinson's disease. The future is here. These advances revolutionize how we approach diagnosis and treatment of hundreds of diseases including lung cancer, HIV AIDS, cystic fibrosis, childhood cancers and Alzheimer's. The Society for Women's Health Research believes in the promise of molecular diagnostics, which is improving the quality of life for millions of people. It's an exciting evolution in healthcare that is already transforming health in ways never before possible. To learn more about molecular diagnostics and the biological differences between women and men, visit swhr.org.